Hey guys, welcome to the Hamster Channel and in today's video I've been showing you how to use your cell phone as a webcam using USB cords. So of course first you will need a cell phone here, then you will need your USB cord right here. So first, um, oh yeah, the reason why we're doing this because some people don't have Wi-Fi at their house or home so we're gonna do this so they don't really need Wi-Fi. So first you will need to download a software called IV Cam. We used IV Cam in the last video too, my every second video I think, so we could go check that out too. And we're gonna press download for Windows. And it should be downloading right here. And then we're going to click it. And then you just select the language or anything. So we're going to press OK. Then we're going to press Next. Next. Oops. Next. Then we're going to press install. Now we're going to wait till it installs. It should be pretty fast, so. Okay, there you go. We're going to press finish now. And it should be here, and we're just going to run run it now. So, we already activated it. When you get your phone to activate, it will automatically uh, uh, like be on there, so you can see it. So now I'm going to install the software on my cell phone, so be right back. So now we're back and we're going to um, download the software and turn on the USB bugging. So first we're going to download the software first with Wi-Fi. We're going to go to Play Store and we're going to type in IV Cam, which is right here. Then we're going to press install. Then when it's finished installing, we're going to click open. Then we're going to press allow and allow. But first, it will automatically not connect it. We're not going to connect it. We're going to turn on the USB bugging. So we're going to go to settings. Then we're going to press, we're going to scroll down and we're going to press this down. Then we're going to press about phone. We're going to scroll down and yeah, press it so many times. Then you're gonna get your password. Oopsie, your password. Then we're gonna go back and you should see the de developer options. Then we're gonna turn on USB debugging. Okay. There you go. And now we're gonna go back. And now, oops. Then we're gonna go back to the app now shouldn't have echoes now and so there we go okay now this is like last time we're gonna use zoom and google me as um examples for your camera and we're, of course we're gonna get my students aka stuffies Yes, I'm going to get my stuffies and they're going to pretend they're human. So there we go. So now we finished the phone. We finished installing and um, all that stuff. We're going to go to Google Meet and Zoom. So we're going to go to Google Meet first to um, show you as an example how to do it. It's just the same as last time. So we're going to press the second link here and we're going to press new meeting. Oh, yeah. First of all, guys, make sure to go to your settings and go to video and press here and make sure to press IV cam. Then we're going to press done. Then you're going to press new meeting, start in start an instant meeting. And now you're going to get your phone ready. I'm going to turn off the speaker or else there will be echoes. Okay, we're going to... There you go. I think it's like that. <laughs> okay, now you're just, you know, you can just look here and you're going to press join now. And I'm going to let my stuffies, aka students or something, and we're going to get the link info. 
So I'm going to copy it to them. I'm going to use Hangouts. And they should be joining. There you go. And you could just like look here. The teacher can look at you and you could do the meeting right here. So yeah. Then you're just going to omit it. And they should be in the meeting. Oh, I can hear echoes. <laughs> oh gosh. My student, that's such a bad place to call. Okay, now there we go. My students are right there. I can like hear the echoes because it's from the other rooms, but but this is all is super easy on Google Meet. And we're, now we're gonna move on to Zoom. I'm gonna disconnect, leave the call, and now we're gonna go. So the next step is we're gonna go to Zoom. Not step. The next um thing. Okay, so Zoom first link. I already logged into my account, so um, if you didn't log in, just log in through Gmail or some other um, things. And we're going to press host a meeting with video on. Welcome to Zoom meeting, and we're going to connect it to our phone or, oops, see. Um, okay. I'm going to connect it. There you go. Yeah, there you go. And you could just do do things here too. And oh yeah, forgot one thing. You're gonna press here and you're gonna press it. E2 eSoft IV Cam because I forgot to do that. And now there we go. And now we're gonna invite one of my students, Stuffy thing, and we're gonna press um chat. I mean we're gonna press this and we're gonna press invite and you just invite it by Gmail. There you go, they're invited, and now we're gonna wait, and we're gonna omit the thing. So, there's also actually a lot of settings on the IV can, so you can maybe like change it, there's this bear thing that you need to be unlocked. And then you can change your, like the photo around, and oh, we're gonna oh, admit, admit, and my stuff it should be here now. I'm excited to see my students. <laughs> mm, oh, um, mm, hey, you should definitely share your face. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> hello, hello, hello. Welcome to class. Yeah. So that's basically all, and I hope. You guys enjoy this video. Make sure to like and subscribe, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.